Let's look at saprophytic nutrition, guys. By answering this question, the question reads, figure 4.1 shows the growth of mocha on shima. Okay. Uh, then the question, first question, which is question A1, is saying, identify the structure label J in figure 4.1. So, structure label J is sporangium. Okay, like this. Alright, then question 2 is saying, explain how structure K how structure K uh, obtain nutrients from Shima for Max. Okay. So listen guys. Structure K, so we can say the mocha releases enzymes from its hyphae into Shima. Alright. These enzymes hydrolyze the Shima into glucose as the end product so glucose is the end product and the structure k which is the stolon absorbs this end what absorb this end product okay then b1 they are saying the shima was uh, was flooded with iodine solution state the color change that would occur a one at k, at l okay at l then number two at k the color change all right so look at where l is at l the color of iodine solution so we can say the color of iodine yeah the color of iodine solution changes to blue, blue black. Okay, blue black. Then at K, um, not at K, at M. I'm sorry. At M, so the first one is at L, then the second one is at E, at M. Okay, at L, the color of iodine solution changes blue black, and at M, the, there is no color change. Okay, there's no color change. So the color of iodine solution just remains the way it is as yellowish brown. Okay, or just brown. Then C, the saying, give reasons for the color change observed in B above. So you can say at L okay at L starch starch was present okay and then at T M starch was what T was absent. That's it.